Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to, hold on a minute, just real quick. I'll turn the volume of my mic down because that was very loud. <laughs> Six, 16 decibels. But yeah, so this, we're just gonna um, carry on where we left off. This is episode 8, I do believe. So I guess we just. Naja. Go down. Hey, these things. Like, this is so annoying. Die, please. Thank you. Getting down is probably the way I need to go. Oh wait. Uh, probably an easier way of doing that, but what's there? Oh. Uh oh. Zenies. Okay, this is where we're supposed to be. Oh, that's right. Let's go down. This appears to be a seal on the sword by the peacekeepers. A seal? What were they trying to keep in? The Eidolon. Where do we enter? Do we enter frickin' Hong Kai Star Rail, bro? Eidolon Resonance? The Eidolon? According to Valhalla's records of the evacuation of the Rosa, an entity called the Eidolon was present to describe the giant diamond-shaped monolith and said to be the most threatening source of decay in the region. It's also believed to be causing a decay eruption in Rosa in order to contain the entity and prevent further destruction, the Peacekeeper Vanguard gave their lives to erect the barriers they could prize the seal. The fine job they did and was surprised the seal still stands for so many years. So I can see the parts will start to weaken in a matter of time before it breaks. So the Eidolon is still in here? How frightening! We try, but has my father ever spoken to you about what happened here? He was part of the peacekeeper prison in Omosa that day. Could they already have known about the Eidolon's existence? No, he's never brought it up. So, it's a here, energy into researching decay, is cagey about the whole thing? Hmm. That's exactly it. Much of his work has to do with purifying decay. I noticed that for years he's been studying, the, studying and compiling relevant data. And both victims and witnessing the devastation, of course, probably spared him to do something. Though the topic of Obosa is one we avoid. Events here were a personal tragedy for him as well. He lost many companions and resigned from the peacekeepers shortly after. Dad was different back then, and not the same. He's a good lucky guy, you see now. I'm just doing my best to help him by collecting astral gears. Using astral gears to purify the decay? Is that impossible? Who knows? Well, if you wish to proceed, we'll find out who has power and these seals and destroy them. Are you ready? Wait, what? We need to destroy the seals? I think so. Why? The seal's keeping the evil thing in! Oh, I can't go that way. Whoa. Oh, jeez, that's gonna be evil. Well, there's all those of the guys that explode. I forgot how much I hated those things. And these things. Ouch. Ouch. Oh my god, these guys are so annoying. Die, man. Die. Please, just get out of here. Leave. Oh, that's a... What are those things? Whoa, these guys are so... Holy God! Ouch. Oh my word, I hate these things so, with a passion, bro. 
Not these guys again. Oh god. Uh oh. Whoa. So many friggin' enemies. Holy. this one. Get out of here. Oh. Just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. Don't worry about any of these guys. Jump through the middle. Oh. Hey, what? I can't get out. From here. This equals bad. I've only got 93 health left. Can I make it? the real question. I make it just by following this path around here. Them here. Oh shit. There's a health thing there. Ouch. Oh my word. Oh, I've got frickin' damn it. How that happened. Ow. Holy crap. Oh. Holy cow. Oh. Wow, they're falling on the friggin' sky, bro. Wait, please. No, I can't get back up. down from here. Hoping there'll be a safe point just past the barrier anyway. It's gone. The 
There is not. Getting some health back would be useful. Just go down. Just go down. Avoid those tainted things. This save point. Oh, okay. Oh, jeez, that was kind of stressful, actually. <laughs> All right, let's go this way. Boss fight, I'm guessing, because it was a save point right there. We're gonna have to fight the crystal, right? Yeah, there is the big boy. Something fell from the sky. Shadow. My surprise! Is that the item? Even from here, I can feel its oppressive aura of decay. And so my senses are picking up something else with, within it. Within it? This is a power that's not decay, but I can't make out part, much past that the case is too thick. Are you alright? I would face it, otherwise there's no hope for Frey, right? Hope. I'll so surely gives us the strength to carry on. Even if it seems impossible, as long as there's hope, then it's worth fighting for. No matter what, I won't give up. Come on, let's do this. Hell yeah. There's a tiny dagger, by the way. <laughs> oh yeah, true, it is only a dagger. Oh god, this is going bad. Oh, I see. That's what I need to do. Oh, it's losing its health pretty quick. It just has a lot of health bars. And, uh, like, a lot of health bars. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, there's one health bar down. I think it has four more. Which is an insane amount. Whoa! Oh, I managed to survive. Without taking any damage from it. What's it doing? This is truly turned into a bullet hell game. Why is my hitbox, by the way? Ouch. Oh god. Can I somehow destroy that shield with my sword. Stay away from me, big boy. Oh no, every time I hit it, it heals. Yeah, it does. Oh no, it doesn't. It just minuses one and then heals one. So how am I supposed to... Oh! Shit. Ouch. I'm 
do that? Yeah. Ouch. That does a lot of damage to it. Oh, that was close. Put up, is it going to put up the barrier? There goes another health bar. Uneven attack pattern. Come on, put up the barrier, bro. Oh, Jesus Christ. I think it has two health bars left. What's that? Okay, I'm actually going to it. Okay, that's one of the most disorienting moves of all time. It's a good thing I can go through it, though. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa! Well, I'm just under a hundred. Oh, no, just over a hundred. Holy Christ! like the ability it has. How the hell am I going to avoid that? How the, how the hell do I avoid that? How? How do you even... <laughs> Bro, how do you even... Yes, yes. So 
its first first bar depletes really quickly. Got a life steal, so I can't take it. No, it doesn't have life steal anymore. Myself with those. Let's help those down. I don't think it's got life saving. I'm gonna need to stick down this end because it's gonna. I think. Or not, I guess. I do not like this boss. This boss is hard. Oh shoot. Lifesteal, I think. Oh no, doesn't. Oh, none of those buffs are lifesteal. They're gonna. We go over the scene. Yeah, just do this. Fortune. 
salvage in case. Great situation to be on the side. Side. I doubt I'll beat it this time, but we've only got two health bars left. Looks like ultimate move that it does. Yeah, I don't know, I was expecting that. I didn't think I was gonna win that one anyway. But that's a really hard boss, and he has so many buffs. Skip, skippity, skippity, skip. Oh, it gets many, many defense buffs as it goes, as the game goes on, so like... Oh, I should not have gone under it, I'm an idiot. Health by bastard. Ouch. Oh, that did half its health, the first health bar, though. There goes his first health bar.
with some big boy. What bounce off a wall and get it back on me? Oh, well, that made three bounce up and hit me. It's not got life steal at the moment, so I can feel free to hit it with them. Things that aren't just the little balls. Oh, it's doing that thing again. Bomb it. Wait, but I can go. Throw my bombs. Okay, I can do that. Oh, 
<laughs> so it's last health bar. Hell, that move is so cool. But I'm getting kind of close to dead. Please don't kill me. Yes! Holy crap, that was actually really, really close. <laughs> Look, something slid out of it. Oh, gross. Box covered in crystals? The memory box! Oh, Jesus Christ, okay, that was actually, that was close. Amen. Memory box, a powerful ancient artifact in the form of a blue box embellished with silver scroll work and an eight-pointed star on the lid. Objects held within are suspended in a magical stasis, never changing. It was a great capacity to withstand decay. Oh, jam, bro. That was, it didn't even use a special attack, but it have one. It appears to be covered in crystallized decay. I've seen such a thing. Quick, open it up. Don't open it up here. There's decay everywhere. I love blue flowers. Is that the suffering? That looks so fresh. Then frickin' close it. We don't want the decay to get inside. Thank goodness. Are these photos? Uh. <laughs> There's me and Frey and the other orphans. That's the director. I remember when you took this photo. It was quite a task getting everyone to stand still. This is the only picture where everything was in focus. <laughs> It wasn't a luxurious life, but we all cherished each other. We used to sit around the fireplace, mugs of tea in hand, reading aloud stories of places far away. We all had dreams of embarking on our own adventures, but... Sorry, I was just reminiscing. Don't be, it's good to have fond memories to look back on. That makes them all the harder to let go of. Thinking of the past always made me feel so trapped and powerless. Thought as long as I shut it away, I'd be able to outrun it. But 
coming face to face with the idol on in my past, I realized that even if I can't change what came before, I can always choose my future. That's the only way to move forward. Now all that's left is to get the flowers to Father Erasmus. That shouldn't be a problem, right, Celia? Big data hunters utilize a secure network to transfer valuable artifacts. I'll use it to send the memory box with the flowers inside directly to, directly to him. This method of transfer is extremely reliable and near impossible to accept. There's nothing to worry about. Once that crystallized decay on the box, the reserves are some mechanism for protecting the box's contents from contact with decay. I'm not sure if it's a good idea to remove the crystals, but they should be harmless. Alright, then, what should we done with this? Once it's sent, then all that's left is word from Father Erasmus. Oh, there's some healing. Oh, there's lots of healing. Let's go. There's still enemies up here. Oops, wrong button. I was about to dash. I don't like any of these guys. These guys are meanies. Oh wait, the top one. All right, gotta get. Uh, Where? Oh, there's something in Morose. Not Tartarus. Not Valhalla. Do I need to complete that last objective before? Uh, is it before I can move on? Probably. I don't think he'd be waiting around in Morose, would he? Yeah, head to the shop. Head to the shop and Anathema is the new objective. But... Up twice. This way. Objectives. Man and Ice Shards. That wasn't what I was supposed to do. That's no longer an objective. Okay. A package. Restock alert. Am I mean charges, which I still don't know where I'm still haven't found anywhere where she is. Okay, let's get back to the teleporter and then teleport to Earth. Uh, Ooh, down. Down. Across. Here we are. Same as we are. Anathema. <sighs> don't even remember this place. Give me my zens. Come on. 
her I need to deliver the package to. Cece, oh, you're here. Not long ago, a customer from the other realms asked me to hand to you the memory box and a letter. Says, Saffrine is taking effect, for it's still in recovery, but her situation is looking up. If she stabilizes, I will return to Valhalla for the parents. The box had leave in the care of CC, whom I understand as your trust. Pray, upon seeing the box, we reconnected many of her childhood techniques. When it's, she seemed to have been imagined this box means a great deal to you both. Yes. Yeah, trust me, how does this box look kind of different? Oh, the crystals, they're gone? Initially, Sue's theory was correct. After I received the past, the crystallized decay adhered to its surface underwent some sort of transformation. It just hatched and reconfigured into a singular piece, which I placed inside the box. Perhaps you'll have a better idea of what to do with it. Rasmus, that's a pretty big chunk of crystallized decay. So that's how it works. The boss's power allows it to gradually trap contacted decay to form crystals on the surface. Once the environment stabilizes, the inert crystals are shared. An interesting mechanism. I had lost the cave for a decade, and it's certainly a testament to his ridiculous capabilities. Don't say that Jimstone is made of decay. Goodness, no thank you. And here I was thinking this gorgeous color would be the perfect compliment to my eyes. So much for that. Some of this shouldn't be traded around carelessly. We need to hand it to someone who knows what they're doing. Someone like Mrs. Zimmer? Good idea. The Chris on the memory box might help him bite me and help in his, might be of help in his research. Yeah, let's go find him. Memory box, powerful agent. Oh wait, I just got it again. That's the exact same thing. Crystallized decay. A specimen formed from inert amalgamated decay. Perhaps worthy of further research. Next area will limit movement and its complies with one of the shooting configurations recommended. Turn to Oasis Cove, yeah? I don't know why I just get the urge to save every single time I see one. So we need to go to not down there. Then Terra Canyon. Here we go. This is where we need to be. <laughs> Probably down here, right? No. Papa was not home. Using the ether list. Ethelith is just this guy, right? If you think we've got to look kind of carefully, It'd be funny if he was up in. Valhalla, or down in Valhalla, or up in, oh no, up in Valhalla, down in Tartarus, so funny. Valhalla's laboratory now. Gallery of mirrors, no. Gallery of cells, no. through because I don't see him anywhere.
yeah, I'm gonna have to look up a walkthrough because I do not know at all where I'm supposed to go. So, let us uh, look up a walkthrough on TV Chapter 5, full playthrough, brother. Do full playthrough. Uh, TV Chapter 5, no commentary. This one will do. For a guy that only has 110 subscribers, although that should work. So he's just in there at the moment. Or done all that jazz. That he's fighting the Eidolon there. That's a boss fight that I don't want to spoil myself. Uh, so. Why? I don't. Okay, so. That's after just getting. That. while I'm at it. Oh, Pal World. <laughs> okay. Okay, well I know somewhere I might need to go, maybe. I've never, I've never been this way before. Hmm. Oh, this great thing. Stealth is Zostra. In the inscription under it says, In memory and in hope I will find you again. Dad never says much when asked, but I can tell it's someone who meant a great deal to me. Okay, that was literally all that was. Let's uh, go back to the walkthrough. Okay. So, yeah, so you need to look through that. So, yeah, there. Mr. Direction. Yes. Where'd he go? <laughs> hey. Did he go to Moros? Oh no. Okay. Uh, he tried. To, they tried. The person that walked through tried to teleport to Moros but got teleported to a weird mansion instead. So let's try this. Okay, well that worked. Maybe I just needed to teleport to anywhere, and it would have worked. Um, was this a destination? Don't tell me that easily has malfunctioned. According to the map, on the upper levels of the palace, man of Thema, I have to get down. Also, <laughs> that face. <laughs> this is new. Trying to avoid fighting any of these guys if I can. Oh fuck. Okay, that doesn't save my game with the rules. Okay, here we are. No control of the character. Grand theater, it looks like it's been a while since anyone's been here. Unusual. The air in here is like anyone. Unlike anywhere else in the palace, it's so still and clear, completely devoid of decay. Uh, guys? 
Okay, yeah, this is the boss that I that I saw a tiny glimpse glimpse of um, in the walkthrough. Where is this trailer? I mean, not trailer. A angel. Where is light gonna be? Kind of looks like a change for a hell device. The wings and all. No, they're not from Valhalla. The room is just being shaped like an egg with grey white wings, belong to the royal family. And memory serves. They're an anima named Mimlock. The anima of the royal family. So this is the room of purifying. Yes, during Empress Dahlia's rule, she had Mimlock aid her efforts in clearing decay. So the Empress employed the help of a giant egg? That sounds a bit silly to me. You offended it. Sable, you offended it. I think you might have offended them. <laughs> exactly. So sorry, I swear I didn't do it on purpose. It looks like Mimlock wasn't a giant egg after all. Anomaly detected. Oh no, they hatched. Quick, let's make an omelette. <laughs> Oh god, this game is fantastic. Commencing elimination. This game is fantastic, bro. Oh, it's got, it's got, it's got as much health as... It's got more health than the other guy. I've got to kill his ring in order to damage him. I don't know how to damage this guy. Okay. Um, how do I damage him? <laughs> Back to the walkthrough. Because this fight doesn't take him half an hour, it doesn't even take him half an hour, and at this rate, if I just deal one damage to him, it's going to take me f hours. And since he has like five health bars. Wait, how did he deal that much damage? What do we do? Oh, it's not broken. It was broken. Well, that helps me deal a whole lot more damage to it.
Oh, damaging those rings. It's only damaging those rings that I need to do. This is very odd. Little candy corns bouncing. Okay, well, like, there's, there's zero chance I win now, but... Okay, that, that was what killed me. Okay, yeah, so I got down one health bar. This is gonna be <laughs> atrociously hard. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I did not know I could do that. I don't even know what I did. Okay, yeah, I did not know I could do that at all. Okay. So now I know that I can do some weird sh sh 
shite, but this is gonna be this is the hardest pass so far. Um, I feel like the Eidlon before was the hardest one before this point, but now this one is definitely the most difficult. I don't think I've managed to get it down below two health bars yet, so um. I think you might have offended them. Yeah. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. How did I do that before? Okay, hold on. That's what basic ground combo, basic ground combo, basic ground combo, basic ground combos. Take a throw, air dash, and mana pillar. Oh. Is that move infinite? It is. Can do that move an infinite amount?
I suck at dodging that one. Hardest boss so far, like easily, dude. Like, there is zero competition. <laughs> yeah, see, holy shit, man. The part before it wasn't even a save point, it was just a frickin' heal up point. I was going to end the episode off, but I can't because the save. <gasps> Thank you, offended them, yeah. Okay. Come on, Dad. damage from that one attack. Okay, I gotta sit back here for that and then gotta dodge those like there. Fire is so arduous. It's gonna be so annoying. Come on, 
29 HP. So hard to avoid. I don't even know why. I literally can't leave until I beat that boss. That's not even a save point. Oh, I have to beat it. And oh, oh, it's so goddamn annoying. I don't have the patience for this right now. This video is getting really long. And it's boiling hot in this computer room, bro. <sighs> okay. Let's fuck this shit up. Easy. <laughs> I've already taken damage. And I've already taken a lot of damage. God, I hate this fucking cunt, bro.
動だ浄化する君たちを許さない。Best I've done so far. Gotta say, would have really loved a save point to be before it. Because now I literally can't end until I beat this bloody thing. So, this is the fourth attempt. I think this is the longest it's taken for me to beat a boss so far. And I haven't even made it past the second health bar.
conflicting it with fragile does. It's pretty good. It deals damage over time. Most health I've been at this point. Boss. how that move works now. That was a round of 90 damage. I need to time my mana beams. Good, because I stand still for a few moments. Oh, I got one. I got lucky. That one. That's good. Oh, it's a break. How can this guy get harder? That's the real that's the question. Well he certainly can, because this is nightmare.
君たちを許さない I just fell into the fucking fire anyway. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, what what health bar was that on? I think that was the second last health bar. This is nightmare, bro. Uh. ね、これ大きな。ね、大きそうです。という。怒らせてしまったかも。Why the fuck did I do that? Why the hell did I do that? Like his first, his first one's harder than any of the others. Oh shit.
浄化する Did oof belong to the fire? Yeah, so I'm afraid that is where I'm gonna have to end this video. The save point, more recent save point. Can I save manually? Let me check my freaking settings, bro. Tab there. Um. Auto save. All right, yeah, that's gonna be where I'm doing this video. Uh, that this boss is oh, my controller just fell off the desk. Um, that's a bit problematic. Um, <laughs> okay, yeah, so that's where I'm gonna end the video. I do hope that. Um, uh, enjoyed this one. Next episode will probably be, given how hard this boss is, next episode will probably be just beating the boss, and that'll literally be the entire video. <laughs> but yeah, I do hope you enjoyed this one, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.